Okay, as you can see, this is the Gibraltar Strait. Now, let's try on the chart settings. Right click, chart settings. And as you can see, uh, the display base, the standard display, and the all information display. So we are now in the standard display. Let's see the base display or the display base. As you can see, the the chart changes already and then uh, we go back to the chart settings we click standard apply as you can see the other informations are already added into the chart and then let's try to click all information display and then apply as you can see there are a lot of information that's why we need to customize so that we can see other details okay so in going back to the standard display there is no need to go back to the chart settings although it is very easy to do just click this icon this one and it will go back to the standard display okay let's go again to the uh, all information display and then uh, these are the menu for the all information display we can uh, click that we can uh, uncheck some other information for example, the accuracy pattern, accuracy symbols, all isolated dangers. If you want to remove that, apply. As you can see, there is no um, accuracy symbols. Which, if you remember, the triangular with the stars inside. Okay, let's click that again, apply. Accuracy pattern, rather okay so you can now see the cut shop or the category zone of confidence of course all isolated dangers uh, these details are very important contour label also contour label spot soundings Okay, we can remove the submarine cables. Miscellaneous. Magnetic variation. Apply. Okay, so this is a little bit clearer. Huh? Since we do not need the accuracy pattern or the category zone of confidence, we can remove that. Apply. And let us see some other uh, okay so I believe that is okay we can now see the chart this is the Strait of Gibraltar or Estrecho de Gibraltar in Spanish okay so this will be our first uh, exercise for you to familiarize with the chart settings Okay, once again, I will uh, do a right click and then find the chart settings uh, here in the menu and then click this uh, menu and uh, a box will pop out containing the presentations, supplementary layers, chart depth, special effects. Okay, so in the presentation, you can see the layers, the base layer, the uh, base display rather. The standard display and the all information display you can also change the color from a bright day dusk apply or the dark night nah? dark night okay so what is the purpose of changing this okay during the night time 
if you're uh, if you're in a bright day color sometimes it affects our vision that's why we need to put it in a darker color so i'm uh, more comfortable with the dusk as you can see you can still see the details okay let's go back to the bright color or bright day okay so in the chart uh, chart depths you can see the safety contour we can change that you can type the number or using the up and down uh, button or button up and down button then you can increase or decrease the number and then the safety depth used to portray soundings and then the if you have safety height nah? you have also the deep contour 30 and the shallow contour okay you can use uh, two color for water two colors apply as you can see okay as you can see the shallow uh, contour or the shallow shallower water has different uh, water color or color of the water okay so that's it we can now proceed with the activity number one okay by the way uh, for the activity number two that is cons uh, customization we can still go to the chart settings and then we need to customize the all information display okay so i have shown this uh, already huh? okay so that's it